no nickname. What's up guys, what's going on? So welcome to the vlog. We're gonna we're gonna do two for one today. So it's a two for one. Thank you guys for uh, following the channel and uh, subscribing. We're at about 324 subscribers, so thank you. Caesar.411. What's up guys? What's up Caesar? So what's going on? Just was it was it easy to get here? Or? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Liar. <laughs> <laughs> was it easy for him to get here? No. Okay. About 20 minutes to get here. <laughs> so so who are we at with today, Caesar? Can you tell us? Um, we got Michael here and Anthony. There you go, Anthony. <laughs> so you guys have an Instagram, right? So what's your Instagram? Yeah, it's uh, Mugian underscore Mike with two E's. Cool. And then yeah, Anthony? Mine's double underscore uh, Reyes FK7 and then double underscore. Cool. So Caesar, what's going on? What do you want to see on the vlog today? We're running out of daylight, so what do you want to see? Um, mostly them talking about their cars and for other people to learn about their cars. Learn a little bit about yeah. those kind of Hondas, right? right? So we're going to start with Anthony and he's going to talk about his car. Um, so. Let's get started, Anthony. So what kind of car is this? Um, it's a 2017 uh, Honda Civic Hatchback Sport. So uh, what got you into, uh, what, what made you you know, get this car? That's one of the things that I always ask. Uh, well, out of all the Hondas, you know, there's a new Type R's, you know, we got a, a Mugen on the other side. Um, you know, um, what, why did you go with this car? Um, to be honest, I like the hatchbacks. Um, I always like the old school hatchbacks, really. Um, but like the newer one kind of caught my eye really. I wanted to get the Type R, but you know, don't got too much money for that, <laughs> I wish. So, so another thing too, you guys should know, uh, this is his first car, uh, right? Isn't it your first car? So this is his first car, so it's not, it's, dude, Caesar, this is his first car, dude. It's pretty crazy, right? <laughs> so, and how old were you when you got this car? Um, 19. 19, so that's pretty good, guys. I didn't have a car this nice when I was even his age. But anyway, this was the next best thing. Um, it looks just like the Type R, just without the wing, really. But um, it still does the job. I mean, it gets you to point A to point B, and then still has a you know a little turbo to where you know you can still you know keep up with some cars. But um, so this car is turbo, which I didn't even know. Uh, you did bought the, you bought this car brand new, right? Yes. Off the lot. Yeah, 12, 12 miles. Twelve miles. So everything that you guys see on here, guys, uh, is something. Everything he did. Um, so let's start with this side of the car. So. So what's this, uh, ta uh, what is it, taste, Tasty Giving? Tasty Gang. Gang, okay, yeah, gang. Um, just uh, all of my buddies, really, just we, uh, it's just like a group of guys, you know, with Stan's cars, really. Um, Here from Reno? Yes, uh, like we all have like, a, um, they have an Instagram. Um, we kind of, you know, just repost cars, really, nice. you know, that just, you know, put our hashtag in and stuff. Cool. But I mean, really cool guys. Um, I've learned a lot from them. Uh, they kind of just helping me as I go. So I just really appreciate nice. that, so. Well, that's cool. That's cool, man, that you guys are doing stuff like that. So I, I see you have a side skirt. So what kind of side skirt is that? That's the stock one. Um, that came with the car, so I didn't really have to do anything to it. Um, and then also like, you know, like with the, like the lip as well. Um, all that came stock. Um, and then same with like the back. Um, the Sport comes with all the side skirts. Um, the, the one that I like to call the CVT is the one under me. It doesn't come with that at all. And then also like with the fog lights right here. Um, the sport comes with them and also the touring but the uh, CVT does not so so what model is this one again this is a uh, hatchback sport the hatchback mm -hmm. sport what, what above this is the SI no the uh, hatchback touring so mm -hmm. what's difference between the touring and this one is that you know the sunroof um, you got your uh, little cameras on the mirrors I've seen that uh, yeah and then like you know yeah. you got a touch screen and stuff so I mean it's just those little gadgets that are different you know that are more yeah. up on the price but you know it's all right so the front end is this a stock front end um, the only thing um, is the grill. Um, this is a Type R um, aftermarket grill. Um, I uh, got into a fender bender with the uh, stock one. Nice. So, um, just, so upgrade. Uh, yep. So I got, <laughs> it was kind of cool. Got the upgrade. So one of the things that I do like, guys, that um, that I do notice right off the bat. I mean, the front end looks badass, but he has the front window tinted. Oh, how tinted is that? I think it's 35. 35? That's not bad. That's reasonable. And then you have your, your headlights tinted. Yep, and you also got, the fog lights. And the fog lights. It's clean. So pretty much the other side is going to be the same deal. Um, what kind of wheels are these? Um, they are Cosmos wheels. So what size tires does it have? They are 18 by 9s. And the uh, tires are 225 by 40. Nice. I like that little, is that a stock, um, like what is it, a gen a little spoiler right spoiler? here. The, yeah, so this one's a uh, stock. Um, they have different ones that you can get from the dealership, but um, I just like this one, just because, I mean, it's, you know, I, just me, my personal preference, really. And it's a factory one, right? Yes. Yeah. Nice. And the rear bumper is stock, too? Yes. 
That, that's a clean um, rear end, actually. Actually, um, I also um, got smacked in the back, too. Oh, um, I nice. also got into a... Um, someone backed into me, my buddy Jerry, coming home from uh, his late-night job. And, you know, backed into me and, you know, kind of told me the next morning, hey, oh. man, you know. But um, he paid me, you know, paid all the damages and stuff. So. Nice. It looks good. But, yep, you can't look, you can't tell that someone hit it. <laughs> <laughs> and then you have your uh, your your um, exhaust exits like that. It's factory, right? Yes, yeah. Is yeah. that an aftermarket exhaust? No, or? that's a stock. Um, stock exhaust. Yeah. It's a, you got a backup camera. Pretty cool. Look at that, guys. Look at that. So he has airbags, so you got your little uh, compressor, you got your uh, airlift uh, management system, and uh, what, what is it actually specifically? This is the uh, airlift performance uh, 3P. And what does that mean? Um, 3P, um, I mean, I don't really know, um, but what to... I've seen <laughs> is that um, there's, you know, just different preference really, like there's a 3H, um, a 3P, a 3S, um, so I mean, it's just... Um, like a version. Yes, a just mod different versions. Yeah, you like know, a newer like, one. Yeah. So this is a newer one. Yes, exactly. practically is what it means. Uh, how many uh, gallons uh, tank is that? Four gallon. Four gallon. Nice, chromed out. Looks pretty clean. Pretty nice setup, guys. Uh, on these cars, looks like the back seats do fold down. They fold down, and uh, but it looks pretty nice. Um, the only thing, the downside part is, is that I can't bring this one down. Just because if you want to look right here, my water trap's right there. So oh, I, kinda, I see. Yeah, so I screwed it in. Yeah, the you don't want to break the hoses yep, off or so. pull them. Okay, I mean I it is what it is. To put it, but it's clean though overall. And then you probably have your spare tire on the bottom, right? Yep. Cool. So let's check out the uh, the inside. Normal seats, right? Um, you got some nice uh, floor mats, like uh, weatherproofed. Uh, Floor mats, uh, a little bit of a carbon fiber, stylish. Yeah, this uh, this came factory, so is, I don't know if they wrapped it. No, I don't think so. I think it just might be wrapped. Nice. So, um, but um, I've seen other ones. Um, like my buddy, he had a different one. It was a CBT. Um, this was like um, like a clear silver. So I mean, it just maybe depends on the sports. I don't know if they kind of you know the packages different stuff to them so but i really like the carbon fiber i kind of wanted to you know match like with this a little bit you know do a couple more things but um i'm just more wanting to do uh outside outside first before the, i start the inside the inside's plain and simple and clean so you got you have a it's automatic and you have your paddle shifters right yes what do you like about this car when you got it that maybe like older cars don't have um i would say the paddle shifter is kind of like oh don't like that noise <laughs> <laughs> um, the pa definitely the paddle shifters. I didn't know this car had paddle shifters, so I was kind of um, a little excited at first. But um, like, um, started you know read the manual and stuff, and I didn't really like it at all. Um, just it was making a weird sound, so I felt like I wasn't doing it properly. You know, so, so you don't use it. Yes, no. Um, when I definitely when I first got the car, I would always use the paddle shifters, but just I don't know like I said just it would make some weird noises I don't know if I was shifting right you know or down like you know so I just didn't want to mess with it just leave it alone it. Let it just do leave it thing. alone and then just you know it, it you know it drives <laughs> so economy what's that economy button this for? is kind of from your gas saver okay. so like basically you know you just click this it just saves your gas but um the thing that I've seen um, if I have this on, my air conditioner doesn't blow out as cold or as hot. So, so that's just, just the only down part. So that makes sense. It's just you know, this is your brake on, yes. on these newer cars. That's so how... with this one, you have to hold the brake, and then that this is like the parking brake. So it's electric now. Yes. Yeah, so then like that's when it activates, and then you just gotta press. Oh, uh, I do see this little. So you like black eyes? What is this, dude? What's going on here? What this. Uh, my buddy got me this for my birthday. Um, it's just like a hand blown glass piece so pretty simple let's check out the engine i mean we kind of we're kind of skipping through the inside pretty quick you got your controls on the steering wheel um just kind of a simple car um and how he likes it um on airbags which is it's pretty nice you know seeing it how well it drops down i think it's pretty crazy but let's check out the engine yeah, of course boom so I, I didn't know about these cars right so so these cars are turboed which i didn't even realize these car these specific models were turboed so how much horsepower does it have? It has uh, 180 horsepower uh, with turbo. So 180? Mm -hmm. So what uh, what size engine is it? Like a 1.8 or? 1.5 or a 1.4. So even small, they're going pretty mm -hmm. small. Damn. So there it is, guys. I mean, just you got your uh, Coils, Earth, Dreams, Technology, Turbo. I guess it's like a new thing um, that Honda is doing. Uh, a lot of the electrical, 
has more electrical parts to it, like the e-brake. Where's your turbo on this car? It's around, it's, yeah, I was just looking for it. It's somewhere down here, I can definitely see it like a, this little hole right here. Like a tiny. It's just, just poking out right there. Oh yeah, it's tiny. It's, it's nice, cute, right? Yep. <laughs> <I'm just joking. laughs> anyway, um, so I, I appreciate you bringing it out here. You know, we're, we're making it quick again, guys, because we're losing daylight. As you guys can see, the, the moon's already out. Uh, nice view up here. Uh, I appreciate your time. You yeah, know, folks. thank you for watching the channel and uh, um, anything you'd like to say to the viewers or somebody out there, uh, like um, to motivate them. Any 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 words um, or advice um, on the on the bags or anything I you want to say? All I can say, you know, is just if you have a vision, you know, just you know, always stick to it. You know, if someone tells you you can't do it, that's that's you know, try to you know prove them wrong. That's what I always try to do. You know, and. Like I said, you know, this was my first car. I never would have think that I would have had this car to be my first car, actually, you know. So, um, from where I've been, you know, a year, I've had the car for a year, and like, I'd say three months, and, you know, I'm more than happy to have it, you know. I always, you know, every time I, you know, lock it, I always got to look back, you know, and check it out at least, you know. I'm always looking back, looking at the ride. Like, I feel like I take care of this more than I take care of myself. How many so. shampoos do you have when, uh, in your shower? How many shampoos? Just one. Exactly. How many detail products do you have? They're all in the briefcase <laughs> right there, and then I got some at home, so. <laughs> Just like me. But, uh, again, guys, you know, let's give them a, you know, a thank you and a shout out for bringing it out here. Uh, again, there it is. Nice, clean uh, Civic. Uh, any future plans you have for it? Oh, definitely. Um, carbon fiber mirror caps, um, carbon fiber hood, um, I kind of want to get it tuned, um, nice. you know, just a simple tune, just to, you know, change it a bit. And where do you get your work done? Um, all from Bad Habits. Um, Gilson, he's a really great guy. Um, just, I trust him with my car, so I mean, it's just, and he's been, you know, he's helped me along the way, you know. Nice. Uh, I've learned how to install the bags with him, um, and I just can't thank him enough, nice. really. So if you guys have any questions on bags, uh, here's another guy. You know, we've done this a second car on bags, uh, an Omar, uh, mm -hmm. so with the Civic. All right, Caesar. So you re you requested oh, wait, 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 on, the, on on Instagram. No, it's fine. That's how I was gonna. No, I was gonna damn, Rico Suave over here, dude. <laughs> so anyway, uh, you requested. Uh, you know, when I posted on Instagram, yeah. what do you guys recommend? What do you guys want to see? Audis, I think, uh, like Teslas, uh, a whole bunch of like requests, right? Uh, that I got uh, the RX-7. And guys, if we can get a if I can get a hold of the RX-7 guy with the Corvette engine, I'll probably do that. But thank you guys for your guys' suggestions. Uh, but Caesar recommended one person specifically. So, and why did you recommend this person, Caesar? Um, uh, this one person has always had clean cars, and when he picked this one up right away, I knew I'll probably do good on YouTube, yeah. and it's a really nice car. And he's not camera shy or anything, right? No. Okay, cool. So here we go. Are we ready? So this person is Michael. What's up, guys? So Michael, what's going on, dude? So. So uh, a lot of people probably know you as uh, the Civic. What was yeah, it? What it was, was the Instagram uh, name? EJ underscore Mike. And then the next mo uh, car you got? It was an S2000, but that one sadly. Oh. And what happened to the S2000? Uh, wrecked that one. So. Now you 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 got a, a four door car. Now you went from two door to uh, coupe to a convertible. Yeah. So you, so now you're to a four door. Yeah. So what what made you decide to get this car? I uh, decided to go with uh, more room because I was just tired of the two door. It was nice, but you know the four door. You know, I can have other people in the car with me if I want, take my family out, so. So what is Mugen? What, what is Mugen? What makes this car so special that it's a Mugen? What, what, uh, what? Mugen's pretty much a brand. Um, I think uh, it came from Japan, and uh, they don't really sell more, much performance parts, more cosmetic, like accessories and stuff, uh, valve covers, you know, um, seats, wheels, all that kind of stuff, so. Um, but like I said, nothing performance-wise. So what does this car have that other Civics... So what year is this car? What kind of car yeah, is this? This is the 2008. So the Mugen actually only came out in uh, one year, which is the 2008. And they ma only made a thousand of these. A thousand of these in general? In general. Uh, they made this only, only the... Both. Only in general? Yeah, yeah. So if you see a car like this, this is going to be the only color yeah, you Yeah, I mean, a lot of people make the reps, but you know, there's definitely uh, certain types of things that you want to look for if you want to see a real one. Like, uh, I think I've heard the VIN number. Um, it has... Mine has uh, actually 846, so... So 846, uh, 846 at the end. Yeah. I so. see that. So you bought this from California? Yeah. So this car comes with a sunroof? Yeah. Um, so these wheels are Mugen wheels, right? Special edition to this specific Yeah, model. these wheels are uh, these wheels are 18 by, I think, 7.5. 
and these are actually the original wheels that come with this car. So, um, yeah, pretty much nothing want to change these because these are pretty nice. So you're not going to change them? No, I'm no. probably later on. But I mean, if I do change them, I'll definitely keep these. Yeah, you don't want to yeah, sell these ones sell ever. Them no, ever. Ever get them fixed? Yeah. Oh, because there's a couple scuffs, right? Yeah. The, but, um, yeah, scuffs, but something I can fix. So. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, they're overall in good shape. Yeah, yeah, no. Does it come with uh, drilled rotors? No, too? those are actually aftermarket. Yeah, those aftermarket. Th don't they'll come with uh, the drilled rotors. Okay. So, yeah. so then um, the side skirt, the, this yeah, is kind so, of an add-on? Yeah, the front end, you know, has the splitter in the front, the lip. It's a, yeah, the grill. grill. It says medium. Yeah, the grill. This is specific. These are actually Type R. Um, badges right here. Okay. The I do front. like the, the radiator you have in the front. Yeah. It's a pretty nice radiator. <laughs> Nicer <laughs> than most. No, this, yeah, that, that front uh, is a nice radiator. <laughs> so uh, he has a little something for you guys when we get to the engine, guys. Uh, it's not a radiator, obviously. Yeah. One of the things that I do like about these cars when I've seen them, because uh, I have seen a couple or one in town, is the rear wing. So as you guys can see, it does have the, the Mugen emblem on it. Mugen stuff is very expensive. You were saying when you when you go on uh, to the Honda dealerships yeah. that uh, if you want anything Mugen, you have to kind of provide proof that you do have a, a yeah, Mugen yeah, model? Yeah, you just need to have uh, a VIN, VIN number because uh, if, if not, then you won't be able to buy any parts from, from the dealership. So, um, yeah, that's, I mean, the, the, the wing is pretty hard to find too, actually. Yeah, so I can imagine. Yeah. So in the rear, uh, tail lights are the same ones as the other uh, cars? Tail lights, same thing. Uh, the only difference is the rear uh, rear lip and then the little like diffuser in the rear too. So it has a diffuser? Yeah, the diffuser on the bottom. Right here and then uh, the lip right like here. Like an add-on on the bumper? Yeah, pretty red. much. Yeah. And then, uh, like I said, the Type R emblem again. And then you have a Hondata computer? Yeah, yeah it's a Flash Pro, oh. a Hondata Flash Hondata's Pro. Hondata's not cheap. No, it's not, but yeah. it's it's nice. So, so it's, it's worth having it? Yeah, oh yeah, definitely. So you have the Hondata? Tune or a computer? Uh, the computer. And computer, how much yeah. is that computer? Uh, I think it's around 600, yeah, it's 650. One of, yeah. one of the most expensive yeah. ones. Boom. So who tunes this car? Has anybody tuned it? Um, I think, I'm not too sure of the name, but um, the dude actually went down to San Diego to get it tuned. And then he brought it back up. Um, I'm going to probably end up in Sacramento to go get another tune because nice. I don't want to blow anything up. Exactly. There we go. So look at that. Nice, nice intake. Uh, what is that, like an AEM or? Yeah, it's a. Uh, version 2? Or? It's uh, Skunk 2. Skunk, Skunk 2, that's two, yeah. what it is. Skunk 2 uh, air intake. Oh, K20. K20, K20 yeah. yeah. K20. So, uh, and then uh, what is this? It looks kind of like a turbo. What's going on here? Uh, it's a big alternator. But <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it's a Pro Charger. It's a Kraftworks uh, Pro Charger. Um, it's actually pushing 380 right now. Boom, um, 380. Yeah. Damn, that's hella power. So you have you done any pulls with anything on the street? Or, yeah, I've uh, done the streets a of Mexico, pulls. I guess. Yeah, yeah I guess. Yeah, right, we've, so. been, we've been to Mexico a couple of times. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we've done some pulls, or you know, if someone pulls up, I mean, I guess I'll give them some some gas. So it's comparable. <laughs> it's comparable with uh, an, an STI, you could say. Yeah, something like that. Um, kind of. I mean, I guess if we were to race and we can see but um i've done a couple races but you know it keeps up pretty well it has good power for a big big four door so yeah that's true yeah. how much does the car weigh do you know um i'm not too sure somewhere around 25. yeah man so it's not it's like in the middle not yeah, too heavy too no, light no. Yeah. other than the pro charger it has uh bigger injectors um you mm. know uh Pro from, from factory or because they put a no, pro charger that we yeah because they put the pro charger okay. in there. And if you're making that power you want to have some more fuel going into the you know so it's a whole kit you were telling me earlier right so what no so the pro charger just came with a <coughs> supercharger okay and then obviously the injectors and the clutch was um you know added on to so what kind of clutch does that i think it's a stage two exity exities are nice yeah. Yeah. and then uh and what brand is the pro charger because uh, isn't it the same uh, brand as Enterprise? yeah this one's a craftworks and then the same thing as the pro charger as well okay cool Anything else? Um, motor mounts, pretty much it though. Uh, just kind of a, uh, pretty much reliable, right? Yeah, AC works, no, it's, a, it's a nice daily, you know, yeah. it's, if, if you want the power, you got it there, so. Yeah. And it's reliable. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Has the smog, no check engine lights? No, no, no check engines, pass <coughs> smog, like super easy, so. Cool. Nice car. So let's check out, uh, let's check out the trunk actually. This thing's huge. Look at, look at how uh, easy accessible it is to get in there. <laughs> so you're gonna have to do the trunk challenge, Michael. Have to get in. Well, I'm, we're gonna see if he can, he can do it too. This is easier, but uh, <laughs> might as well be, be a team player. All right, all right. We go trunk challenge. He's being a team player for those uh, people that didn't want to do this. See, team player guys, <laughs> take him over for the team. All right, set him set on top of it. Not to <laughs> He's like, I'm out. <laughs> all right, so thank you for doing that. Yours is easy, so might as well. We're gonna since he did it, now you have to do it. <laughs> Look at this guy. This guy has it easy, like in style, dude. Damn. Oh, trunk yeah. challenge this is more like i'm gonna go to sleep challenge <laughs> <laughs> oh shit <laughs> we 
quick as he actually lies. <laughs> Oh, you can't get it open. I thought you could. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were bullshitting. <laughs> well, cool. Oh, my. all right. My, so is it, is it Mike or Michael? Yeah, Mike. You can go. All right. So Mike. So, so this thing is pretty clean. Um, pretty simple, right? Uh, it reminds me of um, a little bit of Omar's Omar's uh, SI. Yeah, yeah. Something it, similar. It reminds this, me more this to one's uh, eighth gen. His is ninth gen. So, so it's the next version. Yeah, yeah. So you got your. So it is manual. Yeah, manual six speed. Six speed, nice. Yeah, six speed. And then you got a one. Uh, yeah, Mugen SI uh, nice. limited edition badge. So. And then you got the SI back here. Yeah, SI. Sunroof, nice, nice aftermarket mirror. The, the, what is it called? Uh, Broadway, Broadway mirrors? Yeah, Broadway mirrors. Um, nice, simple, clean. I mean, somebody took care of it. Um, so uh, you still have the old school CD stuff? Yeah. My car still has that too. Mine actually has a program, so Boom. you can actually see. I, I can actually have my own custom letters on there. So. Nice. So cool. So you got the, you got the VTEC light too, like the Omar. Yeah, like the well, mine comes on? up on the top. So when yeah. I'm when I'm hitting a rev limiter too, actually, it turns on red. So look at this. You have an e brake. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not, not a push button electrical. It's just getting fancier. Um, glove box. Uh, kind of pretty simple, right? You got your volume yeah. controls on the steering wheel. Yeah. Everything else will say SI. Cool. So we can't really see much. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, cool. <laughs> Not bad, it's pretty nice. Does it shoot flames? <laughs> you turn your car on, is it gonna be loud? No, quiet. <laughs> turn it on actually, since we didn't get to see it. Oh, look at that. The LEDs. Boom. The stock exhaust, uh, super quiet. Uh, again, he's going for style, right? Yep. Looks, you know, stands. So you guys let me know on the vlog, guys. We're, we're going to wrap it up here. So what do you guys prefer? And I, I don't know if you guys can see me, but uh, what do you guys prefer? Do you guys prefer looks or do you prefer speed? What do you guys prefer? What would you guys, what would you guys rather uh, drive or take, right? Uh, let's, let's uh, you know, comment, comment in the comments. Let us know uh, what you guys think. Uh, what, what got you into cars? Um, pretty much my dad. Uh, he actually was into muscle cars. Uh, he had a Trans Am and then he had... Uh, Geo Metro low rider thing. So back in the days, yeah, on uh, Danes or what? Uh, yeah, on Danes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But uh, he liked cars, um, and then I just really got into Hondas. But well, my first car was a Honda, so I really loved the Hondas. Nice. So. Thank you for yeah, being on the vlog. No Thank you for yeah. supporting us yeah, and watching no some of the videos. Yeah. Um, we're gonna wrap it up now. And uh, with you, I didn't ask you, uh, but what got you into cars? What got me into cars? Um, I'd say like you know, I mean, I'm gonna. Be everyone, you know, Fast and Furious, really, you know, I'd always watch those movies. Um, but I mean, also, I just, you know, I just, I always used to look at cars when I was younger, you know, always had look at like, oh, that tricked out car, you know, even if it was like a, a Civic, it could be a, like a Dodge Viper, you know, a Lamborghini, it could be anything, you know, I'd always, you know, be fascinated with what it, the way it sounds, the way it looks, how fast it goes, you know, so I mean, it's just, just all preference, really. Just, what's going on, Caesar? Uh we kind of um, caught you on video uh, doing your run over there. I guess you're getting kind of known for that. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> so what do you got to say, Caesar? What's going on? Uh, my videos are going to start being quality over quantity. So I'm going to try to promote Reno too and Carson so more people know about nice. Reno and Carson. Nice. And, and a lot of people are telling me that Caesar's super shy. Guys, what do, you, what do you have to say about that? People tell me that you're, shy, you're super shy. <laughs> That, that like you're kind of like serious on my videos. Uh, what what do you got to tell those uh, viewers? Um, I don't know. I'm just not used to other people <laughs> recording me. You record yourself, right? Yeah. <laughs> again, thank you. Give it a like, subscribe, share, and promote it. And uh, again, have a good week, guys. Thank you. I don't know what the hell Caesar's doing over there. He's chasing the bunny. Oh, he's gonna take a piss. Do you guys see that? That's Caesar.411 being a little kid. Look at him. <laughs>